All right, KW5150. Today I'm going to do a review on this uh, Ego Electric Power Mower. Power Plus. Ego Power Plus. And just simple things. I'm going to cut the grass a little bit. I was waiting for it to dry up. So, but first off, we're going to um, point out some things. Here on the side, this is how you adjust the level. Right here, you got five settings right there. And then here you have a quick adjust lever right here. This is for the handle. And then um, got a bag attachment. And you also have a chute attachment, this right here. If you want to just shoot it out the side, we're going to keep it with the bag. So, first thing you might ask is how do you start it? Oh, this is battery powered also. So, let's go. So, here's the battery. You can see here. It's already charged up, one, two, three, 100. Remove it. It's pretty heavy, but that's what you want. Okay, so you place the battery. You lift up this hood, and you place the battery down in there. I'll try and do it with one hand. Lift it up. It's down, push it. There it is. You can press this button here. See how that lights up? That's letting you know that the battery has some power to it. It's got plenty of juice. And if you want to remove the battery, just push this. There it is, pops out. All right, close that. Over here on the back, if you have some buttons here, press this. This is for lights. In case you want to cut the grass at night not sure if you want to do that but there you go all right so let's get this mug started all right so first thing you do is start is you have this green level just green level here the clamps pull them out you extend the board the handles clicks in lock them in <clears throat> up here at the top Pull the lever in and push down. That's how you get it started. And when you're ready to stow it, same thing. Some grass. I've been waiting on it to dry out. It's kind of getting dry now, so let's see. All right, so here we are over here in the yard. We're gonna see. Uh, so that's about two, three inches. Some new lawn for first cut. But still a little damp, but we're going to see what happens. All right, do it before and after. Something else you want to start your Lamar on the concrete and let the blades get going good and then run it onto the grass. Okay. For this first cut, I'm going to put this on a uh, three. Put it on three
right, so you can see, go right here to here. See, so this right here is not cut. That is cut. I set it at, first I had it at two. I mean, I had it at three at first. Three wasn't low enough. And so then I changed it to two. Two seemed to work out pretty good. And you can see the difference. So we're gonna just cut the rest right quick and uh, let it go. All right, so you can see right here, this grass is probably six inches, maybe even more. Yeah, it's more than six inches. And we're gonna see how it cuts that. You can see it didn't stall out, didn't choke out. It went right through it nice and easy. So, so far, I'm happy with it and impressed. And the bag ain't even full up yet. So, that's the review for the uh, Power Ego Power Plus. All right, go and get you one. All right, so the yard is all cut, and let's peek inside. Got a full bag. Didn't get plugged up. Didn't stall. And the battery lasted for 56 minutes. That's how long it took me to cut the yard. Not bad. Now I'm gonna clean it up and uh, see I just knocked off what was on the blades. Knocked that loose grass off of the blades. So I'm gonna clean this bad boy up and uh, did a good job. Underneath, I wash it off, clean it up. But uh, overall, good work. One more thing after use, I don't return it back to the charger. I charge it up like the night before or something because you know you don't want to power it up too much and leave it on all the time because that'll drain the battery. So just sit it beside it, charge it up like 24 hours before. Okay.